Hello, I'm Tom from the Panasonic store in Southampton. Just going to do a really quick video to show you how to do screen mirroring on your Android device. So it can be a tablet or a mobile phone, but it does have to be of the Android platform, worth bearing in mind. Okay. So, you want to press the apps button on your Panasonic remote control. You want to scroll along and find the screen mirroring icon on your app screen. It will come up with a screen like this. This is basically saying that it's waiting for you to connect your uh, Android device. And when you connect it, it will pop up on the screen. So as long as you've got a compatible smartphone, bring it up on the screen. On my phone, it's under Xperia connectivity because it's a Sony phone. Screen mirroring. Turn on screen mirroring. Worth bearing in mind, it does need to be on the same Wi-Fi as your uh, smart television. Otherwise, it won't pop up. Select the uh, television when it pops up on your mobile phone. And you should get a security message on the screen of your television asking you if you want to authorize the, the device. Yes. Excellent. Now, as you can see, uh, what is currently occurring on my smartphone is now happening on the television. As this is a portrait app at the moment, it only takes up a segment of the screen, but if you use a landscape app like I will show you now, it will take up the whole screen. So we'll try YouTube, for example, and uh, we'll see how this looks. Uh, I've already got a video loaded, so we'll just press play. As you can imagine, it uh, varies quality-wise depending on how good your internet connection is on both the end of the TV and the smartphone.